first thing you want to do when you're going to code in FreeSO uh, Sims Online is you want to uh, you want to go ahead and white up. It's the best way to to make sure that your needs are taken care of, so you can code for like over an hour and make the most profit. So you're gonna want to zoom out to the map. And you're going to want to check for services lots, first of all. As you can see, there's a lot of service lots open right now. I mean, if you can't white up, if there's not service lots and entertainment lots open for you to white up, then it's okay. You can just green up all the way. You just won't be able to, you won't be able to code as long uh, initially. But you can see right now we have lots of service lots open and we have lots of entertainment lots open. All right, so in this scene, we are uh, whiting up, and I told Emmy, who had never coded before, she was kind of reluctant to code, that she would end up loving coding after she coded her first time. And so this is what was you know, going on. So here I am um, tipping the patients over at a whiting place for the uh, entertainment, for fun and social, and we are about to look for a uh, money lot to, uh, okay. to go ahead and find the coding machine at. So you got to go to a money lot to code. So um, going to a money lot that has a lot of people at it is probably uh, this place is packed. So we're gonna have a hard time getting in there. Let's just go to let's just go here. I've never been here, but hopefully they have a coding machine. Yeah, because the place where we're at is completely packed now, and all three of us aren't even there. Um, do these guys have a coding machine? They do. No, it's a pizza machine. They have one. Okay. Yep. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to look at, you want to know who's doing what skill. So usually your highest skill, you need mechanical, you need somebody doing mechanical, you need somebody doing logic that's good at logic, and somebody good at body for... Um, here so you see there's three options here so you want to determine who's doing what obviously I have the highest my skills highest mechanical so that's what I'm saying somebody else wanted to do coding with us that had a high mechanical as well but they didn't have anything else and that wasn't really gonna work so you want somebody with like you know a really high if not 20 mechanical somebody with really high logic and somebody with, with a really high body so I'm gonna do the mechanical here and uh, and then we have Emmy. She is she's got it all. So we'll probably have her just do logic logic up on logic, Emmy. That's you got twenty there. All right. All right, and then we just need Miss Fortune. Where is she at? And she's coming. Okay. So let me, um, give me just a second, guys. I'm just going to put it up here. And this is my coding chart. You guys will be able to download this coding chart. I'm going to provide a link to you, for you guys. I'm going to provide a couple links where you can download it if you want to print it. I'm also going to provide a link if you just want to, like, put it up on your screen and, you know, move the window somewhere off if you just use a window mode. All right. So, we're going to go ahead and I'm showing Emmy how to do this as well. Okay, Emmy. Always start each new with AAA. You hit the um, logic is always going to be the last letter of the three digit code, I say. Since your logic. That's it. So, so let's go. Okay, so I'm gonna say A, A to these guys, and then I'm gonna put in my A, and I'm in the middle, so I'm gonna hit A, um, waiting for the letters A, B, C. It's just give me a choice for A, B, C. So we got A, A, A. It goes in on the screen just like that, and um, we're gonna come up here and following the chart, guys. You're going to look up here and you're going to see that on AAA it gives me two, okay? So when you see that you have two, you're going to go to the red. 
So like AAA at the very top left, you see that it says two. So the next one is gonna be ABC. So you're just gonna go ahead and tell everybody, and this is when you lead, you're gonna tell everybody ABC in the chat. And then I'm gonna, I'm the middle one, so I'm gonna hit B for me. Like if you're logic, you're gonna hit C. And then if you're on body, you're gonna hit A. And it's gonna come up and give you a new number of how many of these characters are correct. And then you're simply gonna show, you're in the red section now, so you're gonna follow the flow chart. So it's gonna say zero. So if it's zero, you're gonna hit B, you're gonna say BAA is the next step in the, in the process. So again, I'm the middle one since I'm doing Mac. So I'm gonna go ahead and do A. Uh, Logic would hit B here and she'll hit A. And you can see everybody put in the right toad. Everybody put in the ba. And we're gonna see how many come up right now. But following my logic chart, if this isn't it, if this isn't the, isn't the right one, it tells you that two's gonna be correct. It's the only way it can go. So uh, the next one is telling everybody CAA. And so that's gotta be it. That's the reason it's circled. So if it's circled on my chart, that means that it is a guaranteed hit. As long as everybody's put in their letters correctly and you follow the chart correctly, it's gonna be an easy, I mean, it's gonna be guaranteed if it's circled. Now you might hit a perfect match along the way, along any path. So you see, we all got our money and then we all got paid out 399. This is what you'll get every time. So again, we're just gonna go ahead and tell everybody AAA. So in pizza, for example, you have to message everybody in their own window to let people know uh, you know, what what kind of dough or what size dough or what cheese and they get to message you with what they have. It's a lot harder to do pizza. It requires more focus. Uh, and you all get, you, you know, if you don't get lucky, you wind up with burned pizzas all the time. So there was an insta hit. That was easy. Woo. All right, so we got 399 on that because AAA was the code. So again, we're gonna go AAA again. You always start every code with triple A. And then you just follow my chart. So up in the top left, you see how, ma how many it gives us right, either zero, one, or two, and we're just gonna follow the chart. And we're gonna see that it comes up with zero. So here, anytime it's zero, you just see on the left, it can go down to a BBB, and then you go over to the green box. So then we gotta hit on our B, they gotta put in their B. And then if it's zero again, for example, the correct answer, it has to be CCC because that circled the CCC. But it's probably gonna be one or two correct here. And it's one. So now we just follow the chart over in the green section. We follow one and the next uh, possible code that we're gonna try is ABC. So we're gonna put in our B. And it's this easy, guys. This is how easy coding is. It's just following whoever's leading, just follows the chart like this. That way you don't even have to think about it. And you know, as long as everybody puts in the right code that you put the chat, um, zero here again. So uh, on, um, where were we guys? I wasn't even watching ABC. I said BBB. And then I said, uh, what I say BBB? I said ABC I'm following and then zero here is what we got last. You can always look right down here if you missed it. If you missed what it says up here, you can look right down here and see that you tried ABC and it was zero. And so for zero, we're gonna go CCB and that's a guaranteed hit. So we're just gonna go like that and that's a guaranteed hit. So CCB is gonna be C for us. We put in ours and they put in theirs correctly. And for them, it's just as easy as, they're always just, they're always just hitting whatever down here that's their spot, so like their digit. So like logic here is the third digit on the code and um, body is the first digit on the code. So she's always putting in the first digit and if you're a Mac, you're always putting in the second one. So it's that easy guys. And I mean, I'm showing you guys how to do it right now. So and it's just easy. I'm trying to, trying to teach you guys how to do coding, but you just follow a chart and I'm gonna provide a link to the chart if you guys wanna download it. Um, but then we're going right back up to the top left to go into the box, see how many we get correct. And one, and again, if you miss what it says up here because that does fade out like that, just look right down here and you see that it's one correct. So here, we're just gonna go to the blue box and we're gonna put it AAB. And then you put it, make sure you put in your letter uh, after, you, after you type it to them. So there at the very top of the blue box, you can see AAB repeated if you, if you missed it. You see how many you get correct. 
And again, remember, if you miss how many it is, if you miss this number up here, because it does fade, just look right down here and it'll show you. So uh, we said AB, we got two correct, and now we're going to try ABB. It's the next step. And we put in our spot. And this is quicker than making gnomes. I mean, it's a lot faster making gnomes. Even if you have to go all five steps, the worst scenario here is that you have to take five steps. But we got it. So, and then it's just going to be AAA again. Easy peasy. It's a lot faster than making gnomes. It's a lot faster than, than doing any of that stuff. You just have to actually be here. You can't go AFK for five minutes at a time. But this is how easy coding is. And if you have a good flowchart, uh, that's kind of why I made my flowchart and try to make it easier. Um, so it's one on AAA. So we're just going to go to AAB. And we're going to put in um, our code. And we're going to see how many we got correct now. Or the blue box now. AAB, we're going to see how many we get correct. And then we're going to, since we're leading, we're going to tell these other people the next code so they know what's up. So two under AAB is ABB now. And we're going to put in RB. And this is coding, guys. This is how easy it is. It's pretty quick money. You can make like around 20, 20, even more, $20,000 uh, 20,000 simoleons per hour uh, by doing this. So we got it. So AAA again. It is great as hell. Yeah, there's a lot of grinded games though. But much of the grind is good AFK fodder, so there's that. Yeah, I played uh, way back as well. Yeah, so AAA03, so BBB. So, no problem. So again, if somebody makes a mistake just like that, you just, you know, you just repeat it. Just repeat what whatever they messed up on again. No problem. I told you that you would. 